Today, we're going to learn about how Louisiana became a colony and eventually became a state. Two brothers grew up in a French family which had moved from France to Canada. Little did they know that they would one day be responsible for creating the colony of Louisiana. Sieur Diberville began his sailing career at an early age and quickly became a leader of a fleet of ships. By the time France commissioned or sent him to found a settlement in Louisiana, he was already a war hero. He sailed up the Mississippi River in 1699. He first settled in Fort Maurepas on the eastern side of Biloxi Bay before moving to the west side of Mobile River in 1701. The settlers had difficulty adjusting, but the colony ultimately thrived. The following year, Diberville left Louisiana and never came back. He died of yellow fever in Cuba in 1706. However, his colonization efforts are considered vital or very necessary to the success of the territory, and he is usually considered Louisiana's founder. Sieur de Bienville accompanied his older brother on voyages and soon made his own impact on the colony. He served as the governor during the years Louisiana was pretty much cut off from other help, from 1701 to 1713. He was also appointed governor three other times. He helped the settlers become good farmers and forged relationships with neighboring Indians and Spanish settlements. Bienville also established the town of New Orleans and helped defend the colony in the Franco-Spanish War. When Louisiana had difficulty with a neighboring group of Chickasaw Indians in 1733, Bienville staged an attack on the tribe. Although the attack was unsuccessful, the colony soon made peace with the Chickasaw tribe, and Bienville continued to be governor for another decade or ten more years. Both Dimerville and Bienville have often been charged with corruption and nepotism. This means that they were hiring family members instead of looking for the best person to hire. But they were also heroes to the people of Louisiana for their ability to keep the colony going in the first difficult years. Who officially founded and colonized Louisiana? A. Huey Long and Earl Long. B. Hernando de Soto. C. Sieur Diberville and Sieur Bienville. D. Cabeza de Vaca. Who officially founded and colonized Louisiana? A. Huey Long and Earl Long. B. Hernando de Soto. C. Sieur Diberville and Sieur Bienville. D. Cabeza de Vaca. The answer? C. When did Sieur Diberville first sail up the Mississippi River? A. 1892. B. 1699. C, 1903, D, 1745. When did Sieur Diberville first sail up the Mississippi River? A, 1892, B, 1699, C, 1903, D, 1745. The answer? B. All of the following were contributions by Sieur de Bienville except A. Served as governor from 1701 to 1713. B. Founded the town of New Orleans and helped protect the colony during the Franco-Spanish War. C. Developed relationships with the local Indians and Spanish settlements. D. Established one of the largest ports on the Gulf Coast. All of the following were contributions by Sieur de Bienville except A. Served as governor from 1701 to 1713. B. Founded the town of New Orleans and helped protect the colony during the Franco-Spanish War. C. Developed relationships with the local Indians and Spanish settlements. D. Established one of the largest ports on the Gulf Coast. And the answer? D. 
Nepotism is best defined as A. Favoritism toward family or friends by those in power as in politics or business. B. Unfair treatment of a person or group based on prejudice. C. The absence of bias. D. Sexism in the workplace. Nepotism is best defined as A. Favoritism toward family or friends by those in power as in politics or business. B. Unfair treatment of a person or group based on prejudice. C. The absence of bias. D. Sexism in the workplace. And the answer? A. Sieur de Bienville organized an unsuccessful attack on the nearby Chickasaw Indians in what year? A. 1703 B. 1733 C. 1803 D. 1833 Sieur de Bienville organized an unsuccessful attack on the nearby Chickasaw Indians in what year? A. 1703 B. 1733 C. 1803 D. 1833 The answer? B. 1733 At the University of Richmond. I'm Dan Roberts.